Hello, badminton fans. I'm Charmaine Reed, and welcome to Nanning, beautiful southern China. Green grass, fantastic scenery, and warm weather all year through. Population over 8 million people. City of 17,000 years, amazing buildings, both old and new, with peaceful green surroundings. We are just two hours east of Vietnam. And here is where the action is about to take place at the Guangxi Sports Center for the 16th edition of the Total BWF Suderman Cup. 31 countries, 377 incredible athletes from all around the globe are battling it out to be the next world mixed team champion. And this is what they are fighting for, the Suderman Cup. Started back in 1989, the first edition was won by Indonesia. Korea is a defending champion. They've won the title four times, but it's China that dominates 10 times. Japan, they're here to make history. They reached the final once, but they're seated number one coming into this event. Well, Ireland in Group A, they finished out on top. They won all their three matches against Australia, New Zealand, Nepal. And on the other side, it was Sri Lanka, beating Switzerland in a close one, three to two. Slovakia and Lithuania to follow. What great matches though we had all the time. It was Switzerland that was a total close one. Court two, day six. This morning we had the quarterfinals. It was Chinese Taipei against Indonesia. It came right down to the mixed doubles, 21-17, 21-15. Indonesia pulled it off three to two. It's been 30 years since they've won. And the number one seed, the solid Japanese team, who has never won Suderman Cup, will be in it as well. Well then, tonight we have Ireland versus Sri Lanka. That's for group three finals. Europe against Asia. Well, they're just coming in in Sri Lanka there, Switzerland. Judith is a Swiss coach now. And then we have Team Canada ready to go for the group two finals. Well, there's Ireland, Chloe McGee on the right. Three time went to the Olympics. Well, there's Rachel Hondridge and Christian Tai. They're a solid women's doubles team. They're in the finals today against France for the group two. And today it is Europe against Asia. Well, Ireland against Sri Lanka, solid teams. The fans are getting ready to come in. It's hot and humid out there today, but they love the badminton here in China. 100 million people, they say, that play here in China alone. Fantastic facilities, happy to be here. Great center, the Guangxi Sports Center. 9,000 spectators it holds. And here's the lineup for today. It's the siblings, Sam McGee and Chloe McGee. Mixed doubles, Diaz and Henda Hewa. And then next up, it's the men's singles. It's the 18-year-old, Nat Nguyen and Karo Ratna. He's a strong quarterfinalist at the Commonwealth Games. And then it's a women's singles. It's a 20-year-old Kate Frost versus Sari Manerga, 23-year-old. And then we have Sam McGee up again and Nate Nguyen. It's a men's doubles, Diaz and Guna Telica. And then to finish it off, it's a women's doubles. It's Rachel Dara with her aunt, Chloe McGee, up against Henda Hewa and Sari Managar. Well, a lot of people are playing more than one event. Most of them are playing two events here. Double duty for both Ireland and Sri Lanka. Well, they're just getting set. I saw them get off the bus earlier and uh, go to the practice courts. There's five great practice courts. And in the main venue here, we'll have five main courts Tomorrow's the semifinals. We're down to two courts. And then for the finals, it's one court. Well, to lead the way, it's Sam McGee from Ireland with his sister, Chloe McGee. Chloe's been to three Olympic Games. Started back in 2008, 12, and 16. She used to play singles and then retired her singles after the Rio Olympics. 
And there you have Diaz in the picture. We'll see him again later on in the men's doubles as well. And his partner, Henda Hewa, head to head, first time meeting. We'll go down to the point press. We'll win the toss. We'll be Well, serve and side are decided. A little strapping. And Ahewa's left knee. Just got to talk to her just before coming out on court. She felt strong and confident. They don't play as many tournaments, and that's why the lower ranking for Sri Lanka. And there you have 22-year-old and 169 centimeters tall. She's from Colombo, Sri Lanka. Started playing in 2004, she took the scene. She has her degree in phys ed. She's quick coming to the net, very fit, and we'll see her later on in the women's doubles as well. Well, there's Sasha Diaz. 22 years of age. In doubles, he reached the semifinals with his partner later on, 181 centimeters tall. And again, that's why the low ranking, they only have four tournaments on the world ranking. It's divided by 10, so 173. But don't be fooled by that because they are a good mixed doubles team. Well, they played three already. 21, 11, 21, 8. They won all of them except they had, were challenged against Switzerland. 21, 18, 21, 18. They lost in 40 minutes of play. Ladies and gentlemen, the competition is they all, Both of them also played doubles, so they're six matches into this tournament. And that's Chloe McGee, 31 years of age. Three-time Olympian. First time in London and then Beijing. The best world ranking is with her brother, 21, and they sit at 37 at the moment. Not as many tournaments. And there's her brother, Sam McGee, 29 years of age. Dungal, Ireland. They both live now. They both moved to the National Training Center. And they've played already three times. They got pushed against New Zealand. They lost 21-11 against New Zealand in 52 minutes of play. But they beat Australia, and they also beat Nepal. Today is Sung Gang from China. And our service judge today is Wang Peng Singh David from Malaysia. And there's a Malaysian. He's coaching in Ireland at the moment. Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Sri Lanka, represented by Sachin Diaz and Tilini Gromotka Halheva. And on my left, Ireland, represented by Sam Maggie and Chloe Maggie. Ireland to serve, Chloe Maggie to Tilini Gromotka Halheva. Love ball, play. Well, Chloe McGee on the near side to start off serving with her brother, Sam McGee. They're the 2017 European One, bronze medalist. No. They had a big win there. They're solid. They're fighters out on court. Well, they're up against Sasha Diaz and Heidi Hawa. In yellow on the far side from Sri Lanka. Two love. Ireland wants to come out nice and strong. They are fighters. You'll see Chloe trying to take control of the net, but she's also a singles player, so she can cover the court. She has a good smash from the back of the court, so no worries. You'll see them playing a bit side to side. In 
Diaz comes in nice and strong, good hits, and he mixes it up well. So I think we're in for a great game. Three, love. Challenge at the back of the court. Sam McGee puts his hand up right away. Not sure if that was in or not, uh, but we're going to take a look from Hawkeye. Well, it's a 3 0 lead for Ireland. Make it four. Collection out. Well, Ireland gets four. to keep their challenge, so they still have two challenges. Okay. If you're unsuccessful, you lose a challenge and you have two per game. Good shot comes across the body that time. Five, trying to go high love. on the girl on the other side. That's what you try to do, hit more to the female player. You're trying to work their way in and mix doubles. It's usually the girl at the net, the guy smashing from behind. But if you get a strong female player as well, then you can take extra chances and the guys can rush as well. So it's over. Down the middle, fantastic rally. Trying to get her partner in there. Excellent defense. Oh, what a play. Sam McGee takes a pace off, places it beautiful to the net. 44 shot rally to finish that one off. Comes in nice and high, just hits a tape. Sam McGee, trained in Denmark and in Sweden. He's training with Jim Mogensen as well. Came back and now lives in Dublin. Service over, six, two. Top of the tape this time falls on the side of Ireland. Just can't do anything with it. Three, six. Play. Sam McGee Seven really trying to mix up his smash is not always Seven, smashing the three. same spot twice. If you watch how he smashes, picks his angle, not super hard hitting. One of his favorite players is Setuat from Indonesia, but uh, also Nathan Robertson, the silver medalist from 2004. Athens really likes the way he plays mix. So.
well done. Silver, silver. And a Hewa on the net that time. Just places it beautifully. Comes in. Great angle. Now down by three. Four, seven. Again, Sam McGee going Seven, straight. Seven, Comes in. Eight, one, five, two. Finally on the third. Well, the McGees, they won back this Irish Open back in 2018. the quarterfinals of the Denmark Challenge recently in 2019. A little quick break. Sasha Diaz and uh, partner Linda Hewa. Currently 173 ranking. That's because they only have three tournaments on the world tour. It's divided by 10, so it's tough to have the actual ranking. They reached the round of 32s at the Badminton Asian Championships recently. And the Asian Games they competed at and reached the round of 32s as well. Time a great smash comes across. Now Diaz could get the, his racket on it. Ireland taking a five point lead. Great snap. Watch this. Comes across the body right at the hip this time and then wide. Ireland now up by th five points. Nine minutes of play, 11 to 6. Well, back on court, Chloe McGee to serve. 11 to six for Ireland. A 
great smash that time. Picks the middle. Whoa, tries to six. separate the pair. Well, we have Tan Bin Shen. He's originally from Malaysia. He's on the Irish bench. He goes over to Ireland for a few weeks on and off, but uh, he's still based in Malaysia. So currently, Ireland's national coach is actually Louis McGee's brother. Dan is back in Ireland at the moment. To, so it's a big family of McGee's into the badminton. Joshua, the younger brother, is also a badminton player. He's not here, but he plays men's doubles. 13, 6. Again, picking the spots and then Chloe McGee just to cut it off. He'll be up later on in the men's doubles. Service yeah. over. Fourteen. Yes. Reach the semifinals of the Commonwealth Games. He made history not so long ago. Well, not a good enough serve. Service over. Nine. Fourteen. So a little mopping down of the court. It is quite humid here in Nanning, China. Just near two hours west of Vietnam. Hong Kong and Macau are fairly close as well. So hot all year round. Are really trying to fight their way back now, just down by two points. Finger power there Service comes in over. nice and strong. Racket to follow. Nice strong. Snaps it down. Mid course Fifth shots day. and mixed doubles. Wow. Between the girl and the guy. Nice, nice flat exchanges trying to get the setup. They're very important in the mixed doubles are the flat exchanges mid court. Yeah. 
of it's over. Again, McGee, Safety. if you watch his racket, he 30. goes forward with his racket, and not to the last second will he snap it. He's very clever. He'll Sam. play it to the net or snap it flat. Time Chloe so McGee over. comes across the body, perfectly 17, placed 14. into Hewa. Well, Tony YUD, a year and a half he's been in Colombo. Coaching, originally from Indonesia. Excellent shot that time. So it's over. And De Hewa really 17, comes in nice and high. 17. Watch her racket right here. Perfectly placed. Really good. She changes the angle. She does, doesn't just dump it straight. She changes that angle, a harder one to return. Play. Great rush that time. Diaz get all over it. So Tried over. to serve a little wide on that one and uh, wasn't good enough. So puts it to the ground. Now just trailing by one point. You can see how humid it is, how much they're sweating. All these players out on court. Very physically demanding. Service over, 1917. Tried to change that angle that time, spun it, but Play. it was away from the net, so you always have to be careful if the net shot's away from the net, you have to push it a little extra. Went to the body and Henda Hewa, watch it. And she just barely gets it back. She wasn't sure which way to return it. Oh, just enough. And McGee into the net. Hi, Judge. Now down by one again. Well, that started off with the mixed doubles. It's best two to three to 21. You do have to win by two points. So nearing the end of game one. Her brother, sister duo. Service over. 2017 bronze 19, medalist at the European 19. Champions. Oh, 
Oh, barely leaves that one. Wasn't sure if it was going out. Got out of the way. It could be tied up at 19 apiece. Sam McGee, hands up, challenge. They already challenged once and they were successful, so they have two left. Let's take a look. Way out, but he couldn't see it, of course, because Yes was in the way. One so challenge remaining. Ireland has one challenge left. 19 all. Play. 19 apiece. Diaz to serve to Chloe McGee. And a quick flick right into the corner. 20. Game point 19. Now Sri Lanka with their first game point. It's 2019. That time tried to go wide on the serve. He's really mixing it up. Diaz. Awesome spot that time from Diaz. Very powerful smash. Watch how he gets up. Beautiful. Just gets it back. Right at McGee's shoulder. Handcuffed. Hard to get back. Second game point. Play. Well, the second time, Henda Hewa okay. with the fist pump game one by all over the net. 22, Mixing 20. up their serves, pulls it off. Another flick to the back, comes in nice and strong, quick, rack it up, puts it away. Too hard to handle for Chloe McGee. 22-20, Sri Lanka wins the first. Make me go. Make me go. You cannot say that again. Did you ever Good to feel like this. Like, make me go. You make me go. And then, and he tell me that also. He just, he cannot say that again. Cross him, cross. And crosses are not good, you play him again. And then you must understand. And then you move jet. And then after that, there's something that tells you. And then, you smash it. And you move it. You cannot cross again. Something like that. Diaz and Henda Hewa in yellow on the near side pulled off the win 22 20 against Sam McGee and Chloe McGee from Ireland and down on the ground. And the McGee's come out on top with the first point. Service over. As I mentioned, they won the bronze medal at the 2017 Europeans. They beat the former number ones, Robert Matusiak and Nadia Ziba from Poland. They reached number one in the world at one some point, so that love. was a huge win. Talking to Chloe the other day, probably one of their best wins of their career. Highest world ranking was 21. If 
very creative on attacking, and you'll watch Sam. He gets up nice and tall. He always tries tries for the opening. A little bit too much there, but very smart so trying to attack. One. Oh. They have the fighting spirit on court. Actually, they really work hard. Chloe McGee coming from a women's singles. I played her quite a bit in the women's singles in the past. Two, she went to one. the last three Olympic Games. Started 2008 in London and then Beijing and then finished her singles career after 2016 at Rio Summer Olympics. Silver. Two, oh. Well, Sam McGee also plays with his brother, Joshua McGee. He's not here right now. But there's a lot of badminton in the McGee's family. There's eight siblings, actually, in, in total. Three, <laughs> two. A lot of kids. Well, four of them play, and four of them do not play. And of course, these two are playing. And uh, Dan McGee, back in Ireland, is a national coach. Also, if it goes to it, the women's doubles, Rachel Dara is actually their Summer's niece. Over. So if we get down to the women's Three. doubles, we'll also oh. see Chloe and Sam's niece out on court. Four. Great attack that time, mixing it up well. Four. Three. Service over. Four. Oh. Well, changes up the angle, but that floats out the back now. Service Sri Lanka over. with a one point lead again. Five. Four. Just wide that time by Sam McGee, but it was so his counterattack. He tries on defense really to find the holes. Six, Watch his defense right five. here. Perfect spot. Barely gets it back. Great setup shot though by McGee. all over the net on this one. Comes in nice and quick. First one, second one, right at the hip. Again, always mixing up Six. the shots. Oh. Not too often will he do two the same in a row. For us. Another challenge is called for Ireland this time. Well, they have two after the first game. We get two again, so let's take a look. Lee McGee also enjoys 
horseback riding. Her dad has a few horses and uh, just out. Unsuccessful challenge. One remaining. Challenge all successful. One challenge remaining. Service over. Seven all. Play. Over. Beautiful angle Eight. that time. Seven. Sam comes across the body, and that's what I mean with him. He's always changing his angles, always picking the right spots. Eleven, seven, and the ball. Well, that one stays in. McGee's are up now by four, trying to get on attack, but uh, really Sam McGee's mixing it up, taking his spots right at him. They're leading in the second, 11 to seven. Lost the first game at 22-20 and up 11-7 to Diaz and Hendahewa. And that one sails out the back, but it's Sam McGee that Whoa. is really picking the Seven. spots. Count, trying to counter attack. I'm trying to sit up Chloe McGee at the net. Service fault, fault, too high. Service over. Well, the first service Eight, fault has been called four. in this match. It has to be below 1.15 meters. If it's above, it's a service fault. Well, it's the second Sudermen Cup for the Irish team. They played back in 2007, actually, in Scotland. Nine, four. 12 years later, they're back playing this world team event. Service over, 13, 
10. So a little injury to Hendra Hewa's left knee. It's Play. strapped up a bit. She went to school and sports management. Playing just for fun at school and Four, really enjoyed ten, it. Ten. Well, fast to the net, but not enough. So it's over. Uh, Sri Lanka gets it Change. too much. If you see the way she hits a cork on that one, there wasn't enough pace on it. 11, 14. Service over. Light judge. Light judge. Near the center. Near the center. And Hinda Hewa. Okay, thank you. Second Suderman Cup. She played it last time at the in the Gold Coast. times in the Suderman Cup. Won 12 of them, just lost one. Four. And that was the mixed doubles against Switzerland the other day. 16, well, Sri Lanka 11. beat Switzerland, three to two. trying to get on attack, really flat games. Not too many giving it away. Try to flatten that one out to Chloe McGee's so forehand, so but into the net. Now Sri Lanka down by four points. 40 shot rally. A little change of the shuttlecock. And it's up to the umpire. Once it get ruffled a little bit, it does slow down or it might wobble a little bit. over 17 12 quick to the nets what could we Reflexes that time goes fast cross and that sails out the side. Excellent shots from I both teams at the 12. net, trying to gain that advantage. Really fast, quick racket. Play.
Miss Olga. And the time Linda Haywa really setting herself 19. up. But watch him reach on that one, almost out of the court, comes back in and puts it away. Fantastic shots both ways. Trying to get the back of the court. Comes in quick. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Diaz finds that hole. Fast racket. Just watch how he grips up on it. Nice, loose racket. Good attack. It's right here. 15. Perfectly 18. placed. Down by three now. The 22-year-old. Nice and cool serve. And that goes out the back. 16, 18. Well, we saw the lead slip away from Ireland in the first game. Are they able to fend it up off this time? Hello, you play. was up 1920 in that first game. 19 all. Service over. 1916. Great spot right down the middle. Perfectly placed. 1916. with game their first point game point. 16. And they were game. able to do it going into Second the third game, game now. One, one, one. 21-16. Geese tied it up. All. Trying to get on attack sooner. Nice flat game. Serves outside. Very smart. Mixes it up all the time. Finds a hole right deep in the corner. Well, Sri Lanka wins the first game in 22-20, but Ireland bounces back at 21-16. Are you me? Drop shot, smash. Play your soft mode. Soft, but low, don't try to make the half of the day with the kid. So you don't have to do drop shot. Just take it. Yeah, that's why tire just high. Leg got time to rest, then block, then come in there. This one you will keep that. Play flat. Play mid court too much. Then they will try to get a rhythm. Don't let them get a rhythm on the mid court. Clear, block, and jab, go in. Core two, 20 seconds. Core two, 
20 seconds. Players, back and forth. Final game. Level. Play. Well, the final game in green from Ireland, the McGees. Lost the first game 22 20 against Diaz and A.D. Hava. Bounce back in the second. Try to find those over. holes. You just One. heard the coach Love. from Ireland, Tan Vin Shin. He was saying not to play hard, but find those holes, place it properly, take the pace off. Not a lot of midcourt. Try to take the pace off and, and find those holes. So it's over. One all. Oh. And Ben Chin played on the tour for many years. Actually played a lot in the Pan Am. So I got to see him play many times. Originally from Malaysia, lives in KL now. So when they're in Asia, Whoa. they'll train quite a bit. So it's over. A few weeks in KL, and then he'll Two, come over to Ireland one. for a few weeks. So back and forth. Wide now it's two apiece. Sachin Dias challenge called. There's out. a challenge. Oh, that's well out. Challenge on successful. One challenge remaining. Service over. Two. Oh, play. Three, two. Take the pace out, find those holes, and yeah. high smash, perfectly placed by Sam McGee. Four, now up by two. Sam McGee loves to watch his football. He's a Liverpool fan. Tries to get out to some games as well. Pressure again, a nice snapping. Gets one back. Takes the other side. When McGee started playing badminton when she was about four or five, her dad took her to the courts. Six, two. Warning from the umpire, just be careful when you're sweating. You're not allowed to flick your sweat. You have to wipe it on your shirt or your skirt or shorts. Beautiful shot, what a get, down on the floor. Gets back up, places it. Oh, I think that was in. It looked like it just Sorry, hit the corner. Baby. Challenge called. The call out. was out from the lines person. But Chloe McGee puts her hand up for a challenge. Hey. Oh, that was well out. Challenge all successful. 
One challenge remaining. Service over. Three, six, play. Well, Diaz has played six matches here at the Suderman Cup. He's won so five he's and lost one. He's won all Seven, three men's doubles that he played. Three. He won two mixed doubles, but lost against Switzerland. And the mixed doubles, 21-18, 21-18 to Oliver Schaller and Celine Burkratt. Oh, fantastic get down on the ground, Diaz, but not enough. And Chloe McGee puts it away. Now up by five, but it's McGee that really sets it up. Look how he takes the pace off of that one. And you heard earlier the coach, it yeah, doesn't have to be hard, just pick the spots well. Thank you. Back on court. Back on court. Well, quick, quick weight down. Shwilanka wins the first game at 22-20. And McGee's bounce back 21-16 in the second. 52 minutes of play. Ireland leads the way 8-3. to three. three. Play. Fantastic defense that time, goes cross. Gets back up, not that time, too much. Mahenda Haiwa, really good on defense. She always tries to redirect it, always goes cross. Nice and solid play. Summers fault, hold. Too high. Service over. Four, Service over, 10, four. Play. Great attack that time. They're leading the way in the third game. Four, end of all. Change up end. seven points, really getting on attack, mixing it up properly. Watch this. Great defense. Takes a pace off. What a fantastic smash. Well, up in the third, Ireland leads the way 11 to 4. You drip, you cross. 4 2, 20 seconds. 4 2, 20 seconds. There is There's. Eleven, four, play. Uh. 
Well, back on for court. The McGee siblings are leading the way 11 to 4. 56 minutes of play. Try to go high out the side. Service over. 5 11. to serve up that time. But Sam McGee really gets 12, his racket on it. Six. Yes, yeah, says, oh, maybe he might have moved a little quick. Not good enough. Ireland up by six. Oh. The time so he has does the exact same thing Seven, as Sam. 12. Watch how he goes wide. It's him, finds a hole. See if he has play later on in the men's doubles. So it's over. All four of these players actually seven. will be doing double duty. They'll be back on the women's doubles and the men's doubles later on at the 2019 Suderman Cup. The World Mixed Team Championships. We have a singles, a women's singles, men's singles, women's doubles, men's doubles, and a mixed doubles. Four, First person to seven. win three matches, win the tie. And we're in the finals of group three. So the winners will win group three. Oh, through the legs. Another one that time. Down the middle. 13, Took four to do it. Seven. A smile by Sam McGee, but watch this. Through the legs. Up again. No chance on that one, though. There it is. Wonderful shot. it at the net, goes out the side. Nine, now down 15. by six points. Sasha Diaz, 22-year-old, reached the semifinals of the Commonwealth Games recently, and that made history. Sri Lanka never reached a semifinals prior to that. Fantastic shot that time. And Ahewa, nice Ten, and quick racket. 13. Watch us, moves over, right spot. Comes in nice and quick, That's finds right. a hole. Okay. 60 minutes of play. Yes, feathers. Ten. 15. Yeah. Awesome racket on that. 11, yes. 15. So many options. Just holds it. Last second, he 
knows where to take it. Service over. 16, 11. Instead, it goes cross. Roy McGee to set that one up. Watch out. And Hewa got caught on defense at the net. Opened the court right there. Barely gets the shot back on the court. Diaz didn't know which way to turn. What to get there. Just ducking out of the way. Now Ireland yes, with a six yes, yes. point lead. 62 minutes. Thank In you. The opening Back match. Starting with the mixed doubles. Then we'll see a men's singles, women's singles, men's doubles. And if we have two, it'll be the women's doubles to finish it off. The job. Service over. 18. Quick to 12. the net. Quick, fast shots down. Ready for the next one. Now the McGee's lead by six. Service over, 19, 14. Oh, amazing spot, Diaz finds that Service hole. over. Places it beautifully to the net. 17, 19.
little late on that one. Chloe gets a, a piece of it. Not enough. 16, 19. Quick, quick power. Well, Sri Lanka really trying to fight back. Now just down by three. Finds a hole down on the ground. What a get. Back up, Diaz. Nice and steady, comes to the net. There's it is again. Not that time. Diaz really reaching into the forehand corner. Able to get one of those back. Now, match point watches. Watch out. Great angle on the smash. Perfectly placed. Center. Ireland with yes. the first okay. match point. Well, Diaz, when he really gets behind it, he has these really steep angles as well. Back. Back out on court. Service over. Chloe McGee. Match point. To serve. 16. Henda Hewa for match point. Play. Oh. Well, Sam McGee kind of looked back. Should Service I take over. it? And then Chloe McGee Seven, with a little eight, mistake into 20. the net. Oh. Sri Lanka saves one Light. match point. Play. 69 minutes of play. Sasha oh. Diaz to Sam McGee. <laughs> to the ground, a sigh of relief. The team in green, 69 minutes of play in the opening match. It's a mixed doubles. Match won by Ireland, 20, 22, 21, 16, 21, Both teams 17. solid on defense, getting up on attack. And here you have Sam McGee and then Chloe to put it away. Ireland takes the first, well, it was Sri Lanka wins the first game at 22 20, and then the McGee's bounce back 21 16, 21 17.